I couldn't find my sword. Hello, my friends, and welcome to the four minute drill. The ambiguous naming title I'm giving to this particular hybrid assault slash payload map. We are at Blizzard World with the usual suspects using the team makeup that you saw before you. And we are coming out the door and noticing that none of them were foolish enough to be right at the door because that will lose you this point. We're going to go right down the middle and see what they got. Usually there's a whole bunch of snipers down the left corridor. Symmetra's clearly in play. I give a shout out that Hanzo is off to the right. Our team pushes through left with the shield from Zarya. There was no sniper. Things are going all right. They're going left. I'm going to circle right so that the healers were theoretically separate. I can feel Reaper behind me as I give the shout out as I'm dying. I get the res, we chase down the Reaper. At this point, I'm telling my team that we should let him come to us, especially Mercy. But, you know, we're going to go ahead and deal with them now. Diva dives on some direct guys, and excuse me, we get up on the point. I see Symmetra coming out of the Fargo Deep, and I suggest we look for the teleporter. Roadhog's going in to check for that while Zarya's holding the main point. The gorilla's on point, and I'm beating up the gorilla. He jumps off of me to get on the Mercy one, presumes to stop the res. Nice. There's no apparent yeah. teleporter in the Fargo Deep wow, Mine, but that, taking that the point, make sure that there isn't now. So Regrouping and getting ready for the push. Either way, their teleporter's gone now, so we're good. As we come around the corner, I throw a little healing orb out onto my teammates in front of me. Because nobody is in between, or that is to say, no wall is between the teammates and I, I can't tell that they're yellow, meaning they need healing. All right, so we're coming down the corridor, and I'm looking at my left just to make sure, and look what I found. There's Monkey. I give the shout out. I let them know they're left on payload, and we jump back, and we take care of the Winston. Now that Winston's down, we can refocus our efforts on going down and around the corner. Using the payload Hanzo, as a nice. shield, Hanzo gets orbed and put down. Nice. We then put an orb and put down on the other target. We, I advise my teammates not to chase too hard whilst putting a orb of disharmony on 76. That will encourage him to not stick his head out, maybe get him back there until we can finish up his team, teammate in the pylon terrace and then jump over there and take care of him. Give the shout out to remind my team to look out for Symmetra turrets because Symmetra was still in play. You can see her shield coming down. I got my teammates. We probably could have gotten through this without the Zenyatta ult there. But nice I'd rather have all my teammates out in the fight Mercy. still instead of kind of spread out. So that's nice, what we nice did. Double. Now we're approaching the most, uh, what's good, the word good. I'm looking for? Yeah, I'm Unusual to, yeah. spawn Let's swap in the game, yeah. right? So I advise my team not to go chasing room, after any of their yeah, tricklers yeah. because if they respawn <laughs> behind us and come out, we could get thing. wrecked. We take care of it. Things are yes, under control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now I'm letting them know that we are going to have to be careful with whatever comes out and out comes one person. We take care of them and now we're regrouping back onto the payload. Here we go. The other team has left. And this is unfortunate because there was a player we thought was doing quite well, at least positionally, was falling back to you know key regroup spots. But this four stack, I believe, decided to leave. Uh, unfortunate for the other yeah, team, but sometimes them's the breaks. It happens to me when I'm solo queuing sometimes. Entire groups sorry. will leave, you know. No, maybe there's a, maybe it was me disconnecting, who knows. Anyways, all ults are starting to pop. The one guy who stuck around was the Winston, knocking us around. I give the shout out so my teammates know not to get too crazy ahead, since Winston is on the back line with the healers. But they've cleaned up the front. We've taken care of the back. We slide into the final point. Our Mercy Valkyries, okay. I get up on pretty top in emote, emote, I'm pretty sure. Yep, because <laughs> I like to emote. And ladies and gentlemen, that is a four-minute drill. I don't believe we lost any time getting through the door and onto the point. It couldn't happen very much faster. I'm sure there's some math that some tracer will go out and tell me about, but uh, leave a comment below if you've done faster. DS9 Protector, you're hogging all the play of the games this month. We're going to have to scrub you from the top 15. Just kidding, Did homie. You you're recording that? I was recording that. Uh, not bad. A couple on the flop that we were talking about, right? And then there was that one more that came out. My friends, I hope you found this entertaining or somewhat educational as we took a tour around the map in 3 minutes 32 seconds. I'd like to thank all the usual suspects, Warlock, Sound New, Cooking Pan, Trinks14, and DS9 Protector. If you'd like to see more content like this, please do consider subscribing. If you can't wait that long, check out a personally selected playlist of my most epic noobness or... YouTube has something suggested for you. Until next time, bye-bye!